Uh, Moritz, just how big a match is this for, for you personally, but also for, for the team, uh, given how well things went for uh, at least a half against uh, Real? What kind of uh, confidence and mood do you, do you bring in for this match? Um, for me, it's obviously another you know, great, great match for my career. Um, for the team, uh, it's another great game to play in. Um, obviously, we prepared and uh, we're very focused uh, to play tomorrow and also to make a good performance tomorrow. Uh, one week ago, you suffered unlucky loss to Real Madrid. Uh, what do you expect from Shakhtar, who won 4-1 uh, against uh, RB Leipzig? Um, yes, last week's game, um, you know, we went head-to-head -head with Real Madrid um, for 60 minutes, but then, um, you know, we need to continue to be more more clinical and on our chances and uh, need to see the game you know out till the end um, obviously we expect Shakhtar to be um, you know very structured to have a midfield uh, block defensive midfield block um, I think also they will let us have the ball and uh, try to hit us on the counter-attack but um, we used to this like uh, also in Scotland to have the ball a lot and uh, to have more possession than your opponent um, but we're prepared and uh, yeah ready for the match um, Ritz, what kind of atmosphere are you expecting out there, given the fact that obviously it's not the country that Shakhtar come from? C can it perhaps be an advantage or do you still expect it to be you know, a really tough away game, fiery atmosphere as well? Um, obviously every ga away game is a you know, tough challenge. Uh, in every stadium you play away there will be tough crowds. Um, I expect us to have a you know, big crowd as well. Our away fans will come here too. Um, but at the end of the day, it's us who has to play the game and uh, have to be cool in the head and uh, be clinical in our game. Well, it's given, given Shakhtar's result last week, does it put maybe more impetus on you, more need to get the to get a result tomorrow night? To, to you know, and, and looking at the group as a whole. Um, I think uh, going to every match, we need to get the result. Um, so it's normal for us to to go out tomorrow and to perform very well and start, start strong. Um, so yeah, that's what we're going for. Hi Moritz. Um, with the game at the weekend postponed and uh, some more time on your hand, have you done anything differently in the build up to this game that you might not have had the chance to do? Um, like every week we prepared ourselves um, very well. We trained very hard. The, the gaffer has um, you know, put the, the training out how it always is. Um, preparing us for the game to be ready for the opponent and uh, yeah that's what it is. Доброго вечора. Питання, яке дуже часто задають на прес-конференціях, але все одно цікаво почути вашу відповідь. В Шахтаря дуже молода команда, яка тільки зібралась буквально цього сезону. Кого, можливо, когось можете відзначити персонально? Дякую. Given the recent match with um, Leipzig, um, what would you say about Shakhtar as a team? After all, this is a very young team, and um, this team, this composition of the team, was done fairly recently. Looking at Shakhtar as a team, are there any players that you would pay special attention to? Um, like every team in the Champions League, they have a good side, they're a young side, um, but um, you know we're aware they have. Uh, they play a wild, wild game. They like to be uh, very brave attacking, you know, on the counter attack. They have quick, uh, quick wingers. Um, so, yeah.